In order to connect your controller to the S24 Ultra, let's start by opening up the settings. From here, I want you to locate where it says connections. You are then going to locate where it says Bluetooth. And once we are here, we need to turn on our controller. And once it's on, we need to place the controller into pairing mode. So each controller has a slightly different process. On PlayStation, once the controller is on, you long press both the PlayStation and the share button and you keep these two held down until you get a rapid blinking. The rapid blinking should look like this. It's blue on the PS5, on PS4 it's white. On the Xbox controller, once the controller is on, you long press the share button until you see a rapid blinking, then you release. On Nintendo, there is a similar button, but you have to use a pin to hold it down in order to enter the pairing mode. On the S24 Ultra, we're going to tap the scan button to scan again. And now we see our controllers. Just tap the controller, then accept the pairing request. And now the controller is connected. So I can use the controller to navigate the operating system. But in the controller, tap the settings and just make sure input device is on. Do note that not all games will support your controller. Um, so if you've got the controller connected, but you can't play the game you want, unfortunately, the game developer has to add support for the controller.